It's been a while since I've shopped from Mustard Brand, and wow, they've changed their site. This looks really impressive, and it's making a statement about turning into an upscale designer, with designs inspired by video games and TV shows. What drew my attention was the new Zelda collection. I'm not a huge Zelda fan, having only played a couple of games, but I appreciate the iconic role played by the series, in particular the protagonist Link. Master Bram offers three different clothing items, along with accessories, all of them bearing the recognisable green of our hero. The first item, the Link Voyage, is a coat designed to be worn as the outer layer with a large padded design. The green colour stood out, but so did the price tag, but considering that this is a coat, I'm not surprised. There's a lot I like about this one, but I wasn't looking for a coat, and the hood design didn't really match what I wanted. The second item is the Link Cape, which is actually a sweater. This one is my favourite design. It combines the elements of Link's costume with false leather stitches to create an interesting accent down the neck and along the arms. I seriously would have gone for this, except that it didn't come in my size. As someone who fits between a small and a medium, the extremes of XS and large were too wide for my liking. I could have gotten away with a large size, especially if I wore something underneath, but I don't really look good in oversized clothing, so I gave this one a pass. Lastly, there's the modestly named Link Shirt. This is essentially a long sleeve hooded t-shirt. At a fair price and with my size, this was an easy pick for me. On a side note, the bag looks nice too, with a large design, straps for wearing as a backpack, and a brilliant gold triforce lining. Not something I would personally use, but a really cool accessory. Normally, I don't cover how to put on a shirt, but it's worth mentioning that the large hood can make it a little tricky to put on. You can get lost with the shirt over your head, plus the neck is relatively small. You do have to be careful about ripping the stitching. Now that's done, as I said earlier, the Link shirt is a simple green cotton jersey. It's light, comfortable, and the colour is rather uncommon, making it eye-catching. This would be appropriate to wear on a warm day and fits the casual wear style. The only decoration on the shirt are these faux leather stitches. These are used in all of the Zelda collection designs, though the Link shirt uses it sparingly over the shoulders and low on the sides. There is also an embroidered triforce on the left sleeve, as well as the wing crest underneath the hood on the back. Both these designs are small and easy to miss, but stand out to someone with a keen eye, keeping it classy without being fanboyish. The sleeves feature a thumb hole. Honestly, I must have missed this fashion trend. I guess it pulls down so you kind of have your hands covered up, but this really isn't my sort of thing. I'd rather leave the sleeves down or, preferably, roll them up, and the shirt looks great in this style. The standout feature is, of course, the hood. Firstly, the hood is a rather snug fit, circling the face nicely and reducing the chilly gusts that flash through larger hoods. The rear of the hood is elongated to resemble Link's cap. This is really well designed. You don't really notice that it's there, but its distinct shape will evoke brand recognition for the geeks out there. Even without any Zelda context, the hood has a strong resemblance to the caps and hoods worn in any medieval or fantasy setting, and this actually makes the shirt surprisingly versatile. While it's designed to be a casual shirt, its design, shape and colour, combined with anything that looks like brown leather, turns out rather nicely as a costume. I don't have a master sword, but put on a quiver and a bow and you're a contender for Robin Hood.
overall, there's a lot to like about this shirt. It's light, it's comfortable, um, the material breathes well. Uh, so it, on a warm day, you can still wear this. If it gets too stuffy, roll your sleeves up and looks fantastic. Uh, if it's too chilly, put these sleeves down. Um, and okay, uh, it's probably more suited for the in-between season, so uh, autumn or spring. Um, it's not an outer layer, so it's not going to keep you warm in winter. You may have to wear layers underneath and wear a jacket on top, uh, but that's okay. This isn't meant to be a hoodie, it's meant to be a shirt. And to that extent, it's a really comfortable shirt. Design is good, um, the fit is nice, the material just comes around your body nicely. And overall, I just really like the look and feel of this shirt. And of course, the hood is a bit of a plus. Uh, I mean, it looks unique and people will recognize the green and the really funny hat. So it does have that Zelda branding and symbolism which people recognize. But I, I think the hood is actually quite practical. I mean, it's a close fit around the head. It frames the face nicely. So it does have that medieval look and feel, even if you disregard the Zelda uh, heritage. It just looks like something a peasant would wear, which I'm not sure that's a, a good thing but that's what it looks like so um, the other thing which I do like about is that it's uh, it's functional um, one of my complaints about my Assassin's Creed hoodies is that the hood while it looks nice it just it doesn't sit right around the face um, and it's way too wide and bulgy so if you see my other merchandise reviews I complain a lot about Assassin's Creed hoods the mustard brand Zelda hood does the job. I mean, this is so close that the wind won't cut through, so it feels cozy. So if you are wearing it in autumn and it is kind of breezy, then it feels comfortable to wear. The hood doesn't stick out that much, really. I mean, I know it's a big thing dangling around. It feels really obvious, but I don't think it's going to draw that much attention compared to a giant Assassin's Creed hood. So I think the hood, while I normally wear it down and it looks fine when you keep it down, I think that if you do choose to wear it up, then it looks all right. It feels comfortable and that actually ticks a lot of good boxes as far as clothing design goes. Now, if you've watched enough of my videos, you will also know that I have a thing about branding. I don't like when shirts or jackets have really obvious logos and symbols. I think that ruins the immersion. And one of my wish list items are fantasy based designs. So, things from, say, Lord of the Rings um, or even Harry Potter that have been adapted to everyday wear. So, uh, street wear or casual wear with that fantasy element. Uh, without looking like a costume or a kid's Halloween costume, that's cheesy. But actual street wear, which you would want to wear when you go out. So, I think this hits the spot. It's simple, but it has those elements of fantasy or medieval kind of inspiration. And it is Zelda, I know. But the branding isn't really there. Apart from a Triforce and the eagle on the back, there's literally no branding. There are only a few accents around the neck. Uh, but apart from that, it's just the color and the hood which hint towards the Zelda heritage. And to me, that's perfect. People who love Zelda and recognize Zelda will go, hey, that's the Zelda um, shirt or jacket or whatever. Um, but people who don't recognize it will just appreciate the simple design, the simple accents and the color. Overall, I am honestly impressed by the quality of this product. It looks nice, it feels nice. And I just like wearing it. Um, it's definitely one of those items which I will pick up and put on when I go out without even thinking about it. So um, I think uh, Mustard Brand have definitely hit the spot when it comes to making a good, functional, fashionable and practical design. I haven't had the chance to look at the jacket or the hoodie, uh, but this shirt alone is definitely worth the price. It's worth checking out. Um, I'd say in terms of Mustard Brand's lineup, this ranks uh, probably equal to my other favorite Mustard Brand item, which is the Vigilante jacket from uh, Watch Dogs. But yeah, this is just something that's really comfortable to wear. I like it. 
definitely a thumbs up from me. Anyway, this is New Sensei. Hope you found this interesting. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.